Hello everyone and welcome back to Starfield. We continue where we left off the last time. Uh, we are still on a mission. Eyewitness, meet Harden in New Atlantis. Yeah, but we can't go there at the moment because we are carrying a little bit of uh, contraband with us. Some uh, Varun writing. So we need to head out to the pirate base in the Crick system. So let's go there, sell some stuff. We have plenty of other uh, stuff with us. Uh, let's see, we can already dock. And we still have a lot of weapons. I don't know if they have uh, enough money at the moment, but we'll see. Ship is now docked. Very well. Captain. Now let's see, we want someone with a lot of money. So that's either her or the trade uh, authority. See anything you like? We can talk about whatever you want, as long as you got the creds. Okay, you have 12,500. Uh, no, that's selling stuff to me. I'd like to see where those Varun writings, or what was it? Here, it's not uh, that much, but at least we got rid of it. Varun Zealot orders, that doesn't bring any... Let's see, what else do we have? We have weapons. Uh, this one. Disassembler, advanced drum beat. Yeah, it's a nice weapon. 11 mil. 980 rounds. We might keep that one. We have four max shares. That's a little bit much. I think we already have some in our ship's inventory also, if I'm not mistaken. Let's have a quick look. No, we don't. Oh, calibrated max share. Here we go. 17 times 300 and a 75 magazine 75 300 this is 12 so we have a better one 70 times 300 okay let's sell all of these did i accidentally sell no i didn't uh the negotiator 19 time 12. That's not the best weapon. It's She doesn't have the money for that. Uh, this one. That's not what we're going to sell. Absolutely not. I'd like to keep that drum beat on me, I think. Yeah, let's... Uh, let's switch to... 180. I thought I had 200. What's going on here? Am I missing something? Apparently. Uh, the advanced Grendel. You have 684 left. There's not much you can buy anymore. Except for some resources maybe. Uh, I don't think we have anything that we want to sell to her in this department either. So... Ammo, this, eight. There's something in here. Well, we could do with some less ship parts, that's for sure. You know what, let's... Uh, let's sell three to her. There we go. She has 111. I don't think I have any edibles on me. Let's try that again. I need my own. Yeah, sell. 8. Amp. Well, we don't need that much, do we? If we have two, we have enough. The paste I'd like to keep. You never know what they're good for. Oh, this stuff we can sell, sure. And you have 23 left. Here, the dark lager. She's out of money now. Excellent. 
There we go. You can see me sometimes. Yeah, sure. I know Sarah has also a bunch of uh, stuff on her. Let's see what we have now. Yeah. Looking to make it Let's business talk business. It you don't have any credits. Sorry. Sorry, pal. Remember, all trades are restriction free. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's see if there's someone else here that has a little bit of money. Ara, I hope you actually need just to make it quick. Mm, you have one credit. Wow. Not gonna I guess we're done oh, here, to be honest, yes. because I assume that the rest doesn't have weapons for all kinetic, electromag, energy. any money either. So you have only one credit. Yeah, I cleared all of them Done out. Uh. Fine by me. You want to survive? Head now. Tactical gear is my. And you have zero credits. Okay, fair enough. See ya. So what are we going to do then? Um, we could try Cheyenne. See if we can sell some stuff over there. There are some shops. A few weapons uh, dealers, so maybe. But I don't think they have that much money. I heard that the walls of Aquila City were built to prevent nocturnal predators from overrunning the place. So let's see. Here we have almost 3,000. So let's see if we can sell something. Uh, negotiator, no. Space, no. Not gonna sell that one. Absolutely not. Uh, anything else that we have? I don't think so. So basically, Sarah, you need to give me your stuff. Oh, there she is. Come on, give me the... The two of us make... I'd be happy to carry a few things for you. No, you don't have to carry anything for me. I have to check which weapon she is uh, using. Oh, the, the mutineer. The... There we go. And... You're carrying a spacesuit. Oh, that's a U.S. Vanguard spacesuit. Uh, do we want to keep that thing? I don't think so, to be honest. The throwables. Uh, some mines to sell. Ammo you keep. Resources we can pick up. Minsk. What's in Minsk? Wire spools. Okay. And that's it. The rest you can keep. Bye, love. So let's uh, see what we can sell here. Advanced regulator. Yeah, they have the money for that one. They don't have the money for this one nor this one. We could uh, sell these two. Uh, cutter we keep. The drum beats. Yeah, just fits. Nine credits left. Let's see resources aluminum this is what we're going to keep the com relay they don't have enough money for that uh, they do have for this one credit left sealant I don't want to sell the sealant or the toxin yeah I guess that's it Hi, Bell. I'll say right up front. How much How money do you have? You? Five thousand credits. That's good. Oh uh, no, that's the weapons you sell. I'd like to sell some of my own weapons here. The what's this? Physical damage. Hmm. Faceless shells. Seems to be a pretty nice weapon, to be honest. Uh, this one we don't need. That's a 101 time. Ooh, that's a real lot of damage. I mean, 67 uh, times fire rate, but only a 9 magazine. But you can deal 9 times 100. That's 900 damage. Ah, that's not that much, but... 
this one at about 2000. We can sell that one. I'm gonna sell this one. The calibrated one of this. Calibrated Beowulf? No, you have 610 left. Hmm. Uh, this one we could sell. We have the other blades. Oh, oh, we have only 610. No, no, back. I thought he still had some more money. Uh, the modified Maelstrom. Those are cheap. Nothing else here that we can do. Well, so, some other stuff perhaps. How much are you paying for that helmet? 388. Not enough money. Throwables. Maybe some, uh, some mines. Stun mines. Toxic mine. There's only 26 left. Let me see. What do we have here? Bomb relay. Pick that up from us. Wait, I had some. Oh, reactive couch. 23. Can't do anything with that. Mm hmm. What do we have here? Wire spools. No, 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 not all of them. One. Thank you. There we go. That's about it. Now we have a. Uh, an arms dealer somewhere around here. That's not it. Oh, I can't use it yet. That's the whole point. There we go. Let's see what we can drop Please, off here. I think you'll find that we carry fine weapons of all kinds here. Okay, how much money do you have? Uh, let me see your selection. Here's what I have in stock right now. 4,500. Very well. So you could buy this thing from us. 7040. Let's get this one. 49. Yeah, that's not that much. And you don't uh, buy any other stuff. So that's about it. Very well. Let's go to the other uh, dealer. There's another arms dealer here in town. Uh, wait. Oh, we need to go this direction. You ask there. me, outlaws? Ah, stuff, those ban. Don't make me regret this now. 4,500, okay. Let's see. Calibrated Beowulf. Is that not the one that we uh, use? Oh no, we have the boosted calibrated Beowulf. Fair enough. What's the difference between 68, 30, 50. Okay, we have a long barrel, medium scope, and tactical magazine, which the other one doesn't have. And ours is way more accurate, 85.7% versus 69.6%. Let's uh, sell this thing. You still have 1,000. That's just not enough. 1577, we could uh, get rid of this thing. And that's, oh, we have an Orion for 799. There we go, but we're still overburned, so I guess the rest we drop into our ship's inventory for now. What we don't want to use, and head back out, because I don't think you... No, you don't buy anything else either. They are specialized in buying just one type of, uh, of goods. Let's uh, head to the ship. Oh, can't fast travel because I'm carrying too much, sure. Well, in that case, you know I went to chef school. Uh, let's be careful, otherwise we are. Uh, 
my god. I still can't believe you can do that. Now let's keep running. We need to run 5,000 meters with... Uh, well, getting at least 75% of the stuff that we have. So, our uh, capacity that we have. So, we should keep going. Uh, let's go to the bridge, the cockpit. And let's drop a bunch of stuff in, and then go to New Atlantis. And maybe we can uh, sell some more stuff over there. Uh, there we go. We had 600 here. Okay. Uh, this is... No, this is my inventory. There we go. So this one can go in there. This one... Like to drop them in there first. Maybe I need to, to check everything again. Of exactly what micro gun. Okay. Negotiator. We have two of them. Yeah, this is 65 and this is only 51. So this one is better when it comes to dealing melee damage. Uh, we are no longer overburdened. That's at least something. Let's drop also the spacesuit stuff. Because that's a lot of weight that we are carrying around. Probals, ammo, 8. I think we have some uh, some food on us. Or some, uh, some other stuff. What is it? Uh, no, penicillin. Pankea, med pack. Junk flush, injector. I thought we had some wine or that kind of stuff, but... Oh, the lager, yeah. Let's drop that in storage. This one. This one. Yeah, we're still pretty heavy here, to be honest. So what I am, st what is it that I'm still carrying around that's weighing so much? The resources? I think it is. Let's drop all the resources. Yeah, 107. That looks a little bit better. Probably due to the change of some weapons, we have a little bit more mass now, but I think that's fine. We can always check on New Atlantis if we can sell something. So, let's go to New Atlantis then. Uh, over there. Let me see. We need to be at the mass district, but I would first like to go to here and see if our regular buyers have some money to get at least rid of some more stuff. I picked up something you might be interested in. Okay, well, let's see then. Any troubles you need yes. to share? Yes, have a look. She has pigment. Okay, well, thank oh, you. I miss talking to you already. Anything I can help? Oh, they have 5,000. Very well. Let's uh, drop to our ship. The Advanced Urban Eagle. Yeah, we could do without that one, I think. It's 149 times 25. Yeah, it's a lot of damage. But I don't think we need it. This one the same. Uh, this one we can sell because they don't have the money. That's 800. That's still not enough. Uh, don't have enough money to buy our stuff it seems. What's this with the ammo? Why is this in the ship? I'm not quite sure. We didn't pick it up from Sarah I think but... That's not enough. Uh, that can be sold. No, that's not enough. Throwable, frag grenade. No, I think we pick. We need to pick up some from the ship. There's a lot of stuff that. Uh, med pack, ship parts. Throwables, eight. Uh, we just had that eight. Uh, notes. Wanted. Resources. Uh don't think there's anything that we 
Uh, we could, no, let's not sell that. We can make some stuff out of it, if I'm not mistaken. Conductor seeds. I don't have any. No, this is fine. 183 left, so let's... Uh, Let's go to the, the lady now over here. Okay. I don't see that I'm overburdened. Although, might be, I'm not sure. I don't think so. So running. If it Hope you're finding everything you need. Doesn't oh, help please, that much. Take a look. How much money do you? 5,000. Very well. What kind of resource? Oh, that's what I got from... Uh... Gene tech. Oh, the wire spools we could have sold. Sure. There we go. That's 105. Yeah, that's uh, what we usually are at. So, let's see. Weapons. You have... Uh... Uh, I'm not sure I'm going to sell this one. This one I'll keep. Because that's... Uh... An awful lot of firepower we have. The calibrated mag share, calibrated Orion, calibrated tombstone. Now that's the one that we don't need. The drum beat. Yeah, 60 mil. Uh, you know what? Let's keep it in. Ooh, this is a. But only a 12 magazine. Hmm. Old Fart, Old Earth Ravel. No, we don't need that. The, this is a, a mag shot. That's something else than the. It uses also a different type of ammo. So let's keep this. Oh wait, here we have the modified max shot. That's a point forty-three. This is also point forty-three, so that can go. And this one is a point fifty. That's not a point fifty. The calibrated max share. Yeah. This is eighteen times three hundred at forty. This is 12 times 400 at 40. Uh, 160 mag and 75 mag. This is 4 seconds and it's empty. Thus, 3 times 8 is 24 and 1000, 3000. That's uh, 5400. This one does... 4,800 and the magazine lasts a little less so I think we're gonna get rid of this one in the end but the, she doesn't have any more money spacesuit no not enough money space helmet not enough money frag grenade not gonna sell that I'm not going to sell anything of this. Resources. I don't think there's anything we want to sell to her. Oh yeah, the Tranquila Early Grey. We could sell that. Uh, that's about it. What's in Minsk? Emergency Power Cell Alien Egg. I'm not sure what we have to do with the Alien Egg. But, well, for now I guess we keep it. Thanks for shopping at Jemison Mercantile. Yeah, thank you. We are going to uh, to the Mass District and see what we can do there. Over here. The workup's in the cabinet's hands. They said they'll call for us once they've gotten to properly review it. But listen, I know I should have been more forthcoming about who I was earlier. So, in the interest of full disclosure, there's one more thing you ought to know before we head up there. My relationship with the UC. It's more complicated than it might seem at first glance. The UC's actually the only reason I'm here in the first place. I... 
am a clone of a man named Francois Sanon, one time fleet admiral of the UC during the colony war, former head of the UC Navy. They called him Ve Victus. Woe to the defeated in Old Earth Latin. A title he earned. The program I was a part of, it was the UC's attempt to create a new generation of military minds from one of their most respected tacticians. Secure the leadership of the UC military for generations to come. Uh, I'm more interested in what this has to do with us addressing the cabinet. This Fe Victus must have been impressive commander for the UC to what want him to clone. I've actually had some experience with cloning before, outside the UC of course. Uh, you're a clone of a man. How does that work? Are there others from your program still out there? Other clones? I'm the last. A few of my siblings, they passed when we were young. Training accidents and the like. But most of the rest were deployed to the front lines during the colony war. And they never came back. Not a day goes by where I don't think about what the world would look like with them still in it. Okay, uh, you're a clone of me. How does that a work? A non-trivial amount of gene editing. Clone, honestly, isn't even really the right term for our relationship, thanks to the amount of donor material that was required to bring me into this world. He and I are different on more than a few levels, but there's no denying the fact we're inextricably linked. Okay. He... Would have happily told you he was one of the greats. Ultimately, though, it didn't matter. The man I was cloned from, my father, was executed for acts he committed during the war. The man caused a lot of death on both sides. Freestar Collective and UC. Military and civilians. And the things he did, well... They're a part of the reason the UC and Freestar Collective aren't really on great terms to this day. So my involvement, it could be another obstacle they throw at us up there. I just wanted you to be forewarned. Uh, you're not your father. If the cabinet doesn't see that, it's their problem, not yours. Not sure I can blame them. It's family. Yes. So you're using me to distract them. Whoa, did your father... Do the merit being executed? What did your father do to merit being executed? He had his men open fire on civilian ships during the Battle of Cheyenne. A battle that he ultimately ended up losing anyway. Devastating the UC fleet and bringing the colony war to an ugly end for the UC. But he's also the one who ordered the bombing of the Londinian spaceport during their outbreak. Condemning countless lives. Both sides agreed the settled systems would be better without him. You're not your father. I, I really appreciate you saying that. I just thought you deserved to know, considering how much you've done already. You know, while we've got a second, was there anything else we needed to discuss? I know you got dropped into the middle of this pretty fast. Or, if you've got any last-minute business to attend to, now might be a good time. No telling how long the cabinet's going to keep us waiting out here. Uh, don't have any questions. Actually, I need to go take care of a few things. So, honestly, what's the risk of us accessing this data? Any suggestion what I could say to the cabinet? Are you willing to tell me any more about your father? Your eyes, they red. Is that a result of the cloning process? That's actually a souvenir from my time on Mars. The Red Devils unit I was a part of, they were founded by recruits who'd worked some of Mars' deepest mines. Folks used to adversity. The dust at those depths, it seeps into everything. The human eye included. Where the name Red Devils came from in the first place. It became an unwritten rite of passage that anyone wanting to enlist with the Devils had to do a stint in the mines before they could join up. The Devils were always talked about in such revered tones during my training so as soon as i was old enough i signed up and the eyes were my parting gift okay uh are you willing to tell me anything more about your father i mean we never spent a lot of time together he was too busy being fleet admiral to deal with kids 
I was raised by a pair of guardians instead. Until his defeat during the colony war, though, he was known as an extremely effective commander. Savvy. Perceptive. That mind opened a lot of doors for him. And for me, too. But Ve Victus, for all his ability, was heartless. Ruthless to a fault. In the end, that's what cost him his life. Okay, uh, any suggestion on what I could say to the cabinet? Uh, it's hard to know exactly what might sway them. I'd just be honest about what you saw. A colony wiped out and a lot of lives lost. Something we don't want anyone else to have to experience. So honestly, what are the risks of us accessing this data? I strain from the amount of reading I've got on the horizon if we succeed. The Terramore project never went anywhere. It couldn't. They are deadly creatures, but they aren't Xeno weapons. The cabinet not opening the archives is probably a bigger risk than them handing over the files. That data itself isn't dangerous. Which probably wouldn't be a bad point for us to bring up, should the opportunity arise. Okay. Uh, don't have any questions, no. Then I guess it's just a matter of... The cabinet meeting is about to begin. All parties, please proceed to the cabinet chambers. Okay. Sounds like our cue. Here we go. Let's see where this gets us. Auto saving, okay. We need to go straight in there. So probably here. Yep. Ah, welcome. You must be the captain Hadrian mentioned in her report. You have our thanks for the risks you faced in securing this information. Uh, made it clear this address and decision required the utmost urgency. Oh, I'm sure she did. Yes, well, precisely how urgent is what I hope we'll determine here today. So now, we have two petitioners here making a surprising request. Access to the UC Xeno Warfare team's Terramorph data, currently housed in the Armistice Archives. A request which will require not just this body's agreement, but that of all three Armistice signatories. You see... Freestar Collective and House Varun. Now, Captain, we've all read Hadrian's report on the subject, but we have yet to hear from you. Perhaps you could summarize for the Cabinet what it is you see as the goal of this endeavor. Uh, we're still trying to figure out what we are facing. We can't make an informed decision without data. We need the Archive's data to find a way to stop a possible Terramorph Aquaplex. I'm just here to talk about what happened. Hadrian's the one with the grand plans. Uh, we need to find out. Hmm. That is something to consider. Though we also have to take into account the nature of the data you require. Madam President, I object to the very premise of this meeting. While no one would argue that what happened on Tau Ceti was anything less than a tragedy, terramorph attacks are not some sudden new threat on the horizon. They've been happening for generations. To demand, we hand over banned archival knowledge and possibly upset the balance of galactic diplomacy because of a single attack. Seems at best panic. And at worst, a power grab by the daughter of a bloodthirsty warmonger and her associates. I would remind the chief diplomat who he's speaking to. If it's my father you're looking to address, you're welcome to consult a medium. I would also ask, how many deaths... The cabinet requires to act. Fifty? Fifty thousand? Because if tragedies like Tau Ceti are just prelude to more attacks, I have no doubt you'll get the body count you require. Let's keep this civil, shall we? And while there should be no doubt, the preservation of life stands paramount among this body's duties. Chief Essene has a point. Will a single attack, however troubling, be sufficient to convince the other factions to grant us access to what they no doubt consider weapon data? I don't think it's enough. Perhaps you can help, Captain. As the one who actually collected the sample in question, did this Terramorph seem at all 
alarming to you. Hell yeah. It wiped out a colony that never saw it coming. That's pretty alarming. I only know I was told it's tissue matches from... Uh, no ma'am, nothing special. Uh, there we go. That is worth considering. This attack took place on an almost completely uninhabited world. The casualties were minimal as a result. But if there's another attack, will we be so lucky? Hmm. Yes, a fine point, Admiral. So then, Captain, given the discussion now and the information you've been privy to thus far, if you were in our position, would you grant the request made to open the archives? If there's a chance what happened on Tau Ceti could happen also, we need to grant the request. Yes, it's fear. If the fear is data being weaponized, the Terramorph program failed. The data is not dangerous. It doesn't matter if it can be weaponized or not. The archives need to remain sealed for now. There's no reason to rush into a decision of this magnitude. That? I hadn't thought of that, Captain. An excellent point indeed. The other powers would likely be much more inclined to work with us knowing that. Chief Diplomat. That? That point? Is a good one. Very well, you have my agreement. The galaxy is lucky you were here today, Captain. You and I are in agreement, Chief Diplomat. So, if there are no other objections, I believe we can agree to give our full backing to make the request to... <gasps> what was that? Incident? Chief Sarkin, what's happening? There's been an attack at the spaceport. Terramorphs. Terramorphs? More attacks. Just as predicted. Good God. Damn it. They're here. Now. There... There must be another explanation. The creatures evaded our scanner somehow. There will be plenty of time for conjecture Later. Chief Sarkin, order the evacuation of the spaceport and have your men contain the things, but do it discreetly. The last thing we need is a citywide panic. Yes, ma'am. Admiral Logan, the local barracks can provide support? I'll make the order myself. Nearest anti Xeno squad, though, is off world. It's going to take a while to bring them in. Well, then, we'll have to make do with the tools we've got. You two. We can't risk those things getting out of the spaceport. I want you both on the next train there. We'll let them know you're coming, and that you've dealt with these things before. Now go show them how it's done. We're on it, ma'am. Captain, I'm right behind you. Let's get All down right. there. Let's go. What's this for the... Uh, inaccessible, okay. So, we probably need to pick up some better weapons now. I don't think my... Usual, uh, where's the, the elevator? Authorized personnel only. Where do we need to go? Uh, that direction? Wait. Am I missing something? Oh, here is the elevator. Oops. I thought we had an access to it. But I need something with a lot of ammo and a... Oh boy, what's going on there? Let's not kill him. We don't want that. There we go. That's it. Now hit him with everything. I think we got him. No, oh, this one is still. Uh, this one is still. Come on. There we go. Are they dead? No, I don't think so, do they? Assess the situation at the net station. Okay, well let's see what kind of weapons I have. I probably can't go back to my ship to pick up something. That's a little bit inconvenient, but we'll see what we have and what we can do. I need something with more firepower than I have at the moment. Uh, the Astatamer could be something, but... 
this is not really helpful uh you i've got 918 this is 3000 rounds I mean, 31 physics and 112 fire rate. That makes uh, just over 3,000. On a pre uh, reasonable distance, 40. Don't want to get too close. Uh, this one doesn't help us much. This one. But that's close range. We have 277 rounds. But only 6 every time. That might be... I think we need to go for the, the max share. 13 yeah that might be our best choice for now still have 800 rounds that's only three times no it's 10 rounds just over 10 rounds 75 each magazine modified grendel could give us a lot of damage not that much though this is 75 times 300 uh, no wrong 75 times 13 that's basically around 750 850 close to to 900 and if i pump out this one that's 50 times 16 that's 800 do we have anything else i got this one 60 times 28 on each magazine that's roughly more than 1200 mm, oh my this is uh the aster tamer is only four it's a lot of damage but 50 5 times 27, that seems to be a lot of damage. That's 1100 and another... That's around 1500 for each magazine. That could help out. I mean, it's not much, but it's, it's much compared to the amount of we can do. In, in one second, we... It's one second or one minute. I'm not quite sure. Fire rate, I think, is 60 per minute, isn't it? So every minute, 1100. Now this one does only 30, but from a bigger distance. You have 900, you have just over 1000 in the magazine. Because a reloading costs us time. This one is 600 and 6 times 7 is 420, that's just over 1000. Would be nice for short range. I have to check which we have on use but i think i'm going for oh i have my powers on five but i don't need to have this one i better off probably with something else let's see which one haven't i Uh, that's not much, yeah, it's a AEM, but I don't think that helps us much. The Varun, let's, you know what, let's, uh, no, do that there. On five. At least we have got it equipped. We need, uh, this one, the Maelstrom. I'd like to use that one for now. Gives me a little bit more firepower in a minute. 55 is that max yet so let's see we need to go by train well we could go uh yeah come on okay not where do we need to go oh wait we need to talk to this guy here or her thank god you got here when you did i i just wish it hadn't come to that yeah what the hell happened back there captain there's no excuse for using lethal force here. Uh... Or you could have used the EM gun like you were ordered. These are lives you're playing with here. So get your head in the game. Understand? All right, all right. Now, officer, the way those people were acting, I've seen this before. They were under the Terramorph's influence, weren't they? I... I don't know. They were down at the port, and they just started screaming. We tried to restrain them, get them on the train to get them out of harm's way, but but some of the other officers down there, we couldn't restrain them fast enough. They just started firing on us. People we knew. They went berserk. Fermonic projection. 
some terramorphs, they can induce this fog. It affects everyone differently, but some people just lose control, turn against everyone around them, even if they don't want to. They're like a puppet. You kill the morph, you break the hold. But this means we're gonna need to be real careful with our fire and keep that EM weapon at the ready. I'm not sure if I... Uh, if someone comes, I'll put them down. Sounds like we need to hustle. Are you suggesting Terramorphs can control some minds? I'm not suggesting. It's documented behavior. The result of the projection, though, can vary wildly. Some folks just shrug it off. Others hallucinate. And some lose control altogether. They'll lash out at anyone around them. But still, be aware while they're doing it. Those yeah. cases, you'll either need to knock them out with EM fire, or free them by killing the Terramorph. Okay, so it does mean that it would... Uh... I honestly was just wondering the same thing. But no, you don't need to worry about me. I've had a Terramorph try it on me before. I'm not susceptible. So we'll just have to make sure to watch out for each other down there. Okay, uh... Let's do it. Nat's unlocked. Please, do what you can to help them. Okay. Well, I guess we accidentally killed them. Uh, that was not to our attention, but... And I don't think I have an EM weapon on me, do I? I can check it quickly. Uh, not this one. Now we... I think we put it in, uh, in storage, didn't we? In the ship. Oh, we have an EM weapon. Oh, the cutter. That's an energy weapon. That's not an EM weapon. Oh, yeah, we do have an EM weapon. Wait, here. The scouts... Okay, let's uh, equip that on number five then. Just to make sure. Because I don't need a blade at the moment. Let's do that. And then for now... Let's pick this one up. There we go. And when we're at... Uh, then we need this one. Okay, five and one. Now let's see what we can do. Spaceport. If someone's coming yelling at us, we shoot them with... Uh, Why can't I jump? I'd like to get on here. It doesn't give me enough firepower. I need more firepower, damn it. Let's see, this is calibrated. I need something bigger. Much bigger. I need those. Uh, not this one. Not this one. I need this one. There we go. Let's see if we can hit him with that. There 
it is! Open fire! Fire, damn it! Hey! Put down your weapons. No way. We just want to be friends. No, they don't want to be friends. They're here to hurt me. And we're gonna kill you. No matter what you say. It's right there. I think that was the last of them. There we go. Got him. Approach the officer in charge. Be a little bit dizzy. Officer? Are you in this woman? Experts? Take whatever we can get right now. We've got the remaining creatures locked down on the landing pad, but we're barely holding our perimeter. Okay. They said you've done this before, huh? Well, we've got one fire team to spare and whatever supplies you need, but I I can't risk them taking over any more of my men. I understand. Put those things down and do it fast. We will hold them as best we can. Sure. I'm not sure how many are left. Be careful. Uh, I need some stuff. I got that. Anything more over here? Well, we're not done yet, but I'd like to pick up all the stuff that we can get here. But there seem to be more. Okay, so we're not done yet. Spaceport has been on lockdown, that's good. So, let's see, we need to go in that direction. Did we already check this one out? Yeah. It's a mess here, jeez. So where is it? You know what? I might need something like this. You're not getting away. Wait, why me. don't you fire? Could use maybe a little bit of a better weapon. Uh, let me see. I'd like to see that max share. I think I'm gonna need that one. Let's see if that works out a little bit. There it is! Open fire! Fire! Damn it! That's better. I'm coming for you. There we go. That's another one. Very well. Ah, they're not too tough. They look tough, but they're not that good. So let's find the other one. I think she is funny. And can mess around with us. So where is it? There it is. Yeah. Draw your attention to me. Save, save, save. 
Never safe, never safe. Never safe. It's starting to shift. Uh, look at that. Where is it? Over here? No! No, 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 no. Now come on, uh, load, please, thank you. I mean, am I uh, pretty uh, dangerous down there? What's Sarah doing down there? Get some high cover, uh, ladies. You have to help me. What is this? A new surprise? Let's see how quickly it can die. I'm out of ammo. Okay, let's uh, pick up another weapon. Something similar. Key hauler could do the max. Yeah, we have the modified Crandall. Uh, no cutter. No. Oh, come on. I Yeah, I have all of those weapons are on my ship that have multiple uh, shots. Let's go for the uh, normal Grendel then, I guess. Or the, the boosted Grendel. No. Need the modified Grendel, this one. Not as much firepower, but I think it will do. There's another one, they're underwear. It's dead. There we go. Target down. Nice work, Captain. It's over. Thank God. If these things reached the populated areas of the city, we would have had an absolute massacre on our hands. So let's speak to the captain. Or oh, what was it? Not sure if it was a captain or a sergeant or whatever, but at least they're dead. Hmm. Yes, they weren't kidding about you too. The universe put the right people in the right place. You're all held. The line, you're the heroes here, not us. Hmm. Certainly doesn't feel like it. I don't want to think what would have happened if you two hadn't been here. Just glad we could rise to the occasion. Captain, we should report back to the President. Let her know the Terramorphs have been dealt with. Take care of yourself, Sergeant. Okay, report to the president, Abello, and the mast cabinet chambers. Very well. Damn, all that firepower on our ship. All those weapons, and I couldn't reach them because spaceport was not accessible. Ah, uh, man, that sucks. Well, it is what it is, but we dealt with it. It's fine. Oh, we're already an hour in, so I guess we uh, make a cut uh, right here. Call it an episode. I'd like to thank you all for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you haven't already done so. And hopefully until the next time. Bye for now.